Hi, what's up, everybody? Welcome to Rich Life Insider. We're gonna talk about why did Bitcoin dropped, and also why do I think Bitcoin is gonna go up more in future. So, if you look at Bitcoin, Bitcoin hit forty thousand above on June fourteenth, Monday and Tuesday. Then it dropped. You know, it jumped because uh, Elon Musk tweeted that a Tesla could be accepting Bitcoin in future. You know, it, once the Bitcoin miners move to more clean and renewable energy and uh, so the Bitcoin drop after that so I uh, like I said before before it's really important that 30,000 and 42,000 price point if Bitcoin break out 42,000 it could go up higher but if Bitcoin goes down below 30,000 it could go down lower probably to 20,000 it might not hit 20,000 but it, you know 23,000 25,000 is possible so it's really important it did not break 42,000 that it went back down again why did it happen because SEC SEC delays approval of Bitcoin ETF so everybody ha was expecting you know big SEC approve it because that's gonna be an, the next level step of approval you know can they approve it from institutions so if SEC approved this ETF, institutions and billionaires, hedge funds can invest in those, those ETF for that. So there are different types of uh, levels, you know, when you, when you become a security. So like say for a company stock, you know, a small company cannot list to a NASDAQ or NYSC uh, right at the beginning. So what do they do? They have to go to the OTC market. OTC market, so once they hit criteria to be listed on NASDAQ and NYSC, then they can get listed on those exchanges. Then what, what what happens after that? The big funds, institutions gonna be investing in the, uh, in those stocks. So that's really really uh, the next level step of approval. Similarly, Bitcoin. Right now, Coinbase and other crypto exchanges has Bitcoin. So that's one level of approval. You know, one level acceptance by retail investor, but not the big institution. The big institution, uh, but so to go in the right direction so this is the in the right direction so if SEC approve it that's gonna be great it's gonna be next level as and, and there are a normal reason why SEC does, doesn't approve it you know remember SEC has a new chairman you know who used to be teaching digital assets in a university so everybody was expecting he's gonna be more lenient or he's gonna has a more chance to approve to make it legitimize uh, cryptocurrencies and uh, Bitcoin, but this happened. Remember, SEC might be working with. It's, this is my opinion. Might be working with uh, Treasury Secretary Janet Yellen, Jerome Powell, you know, Federal Reserve, and also President Joe Biden administration. So they cannot just approve right away because they are also worried about market manipulations as well. You know, there are a lot of things. So once they approve it, it's gonna be like. You know the next step will be approved by the president Joe Biden administration and treasury secretary and Jerome Powell. So they are def definitely, in my opinion, discussing a uh, should we make make it more legitimize the Bitcoin or what? What should we do about it? You know there should be some regulation coming before we approve this further. So that's why they delayed it, approve it. But one good news I want to share is that. Macro strategy raises 500 million from bond shares, bond sales from to buy more bitcoins. This is this is really great news, because he this Michael Saylor he's very very bullish, you know, very very bullish for on bitcoin because our uh, U.S. uh treasure treasury Federal Reserve has been printing so much money, so he doesn't want to hold cash on a balance sheet. He prefers to hold bitcoin on the balance sheet. So he says bonds. To buy more bitcoins what is a bond so if you are beginner to the uh, financial markets bond is a promise by the company to pay you back at the end of the term it can be 10 years it can be 15 years it can be 30 years plus coupon coupon means interest you know they're gonna pay you interest every quarter you know, or every month depending on the, and on the type of bond usually it's every quarter every quarter they pay you you know so you get the principal back at the end of the term a plus interest payment interest payment so depending on the if the company is doesn't go bankrupt you know if the company stay operating so but even if they go bankrupt you are the first in line to receive the assets 
So the bond is much more safer assets than equity. Equities usually goes down much faster than the bond. Not only that, micro strategy is raising one uh, billion in stock. So that's a lot. That, that to buy more bitcoins, that's a that's a lot of money. So just think about it. Think about it. see he raised five hundred million to in bond, and also he's gonna raise one billion stock. So that's why micro strategy stock jumped for the past uh, five days. You know from five hundred fourteen to six hundred twenty seven plus. You year to date is forty five percent. Uh, one year, uh, four hundred nine percent. So five times. So the highest it ever was was one thousand two hundred. So if you believe in Bitcoin, if you but you also want to buy stocks, not Bitcoin directly. You know, this company could be your your, your good choice. You know, I'm not a financial advisor. I'm just telling you this company has buy Bitcoin a lot, a lot. So so this this is an IT company. So as a fundamental sort of business, you know this company is not growing. But Bitcoin, if Bitcoin goes up higher, this company could go. The stock price could go up really high. But this used to be 145. If you believe that hey, this is a bubble, you know, like Tesla, hey, you know, 145. This this company jump like more than six times. So I I don't believe it. Don't buy it. Just don't buy it. But if you believe in Bitcoin and if you believe in the company, you know, so be it. Knock yourself out. You know, yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, you should don't forget to get free stars uh, you know, and cryptocurrency in the link down in the description below. So thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.